Right, folks. Um, I was going through the uh, internet, as you do, scrolling up, uh, looking at all the new stuff that's coming out now. And uh, Costa have the uh, veggie sandwich, veggie toaster. I didn't bother with that. <sighs> Bloody... No, I just didn't bother with it. Uh, but... Thanks to Gemma and Molly, uh, I've just been to Costa. Um, I'm going to start wearing a disguise of a wig and a beard and I don't know, I'm getting recognised. Um, so anyway, I went in and I've had the pink coffee. It's the Ruby Coffee. Ru oh, I forgot what it's called. Ruby something or other. Hold on, I'll bring it up on here. Right, hold on. It's uh, the do do It's uh, one one standout of the new menu is the pink ruby choc cocoa hot chocolate uh which is super instagrammable and comes in at the right time for valentine's day ruby chocolate is a hot item right now right now um with a sweet sorry for shouting folks people are listening to this on the earphones sorry uh with a sweet yet sour taste that's different to your standard milk, dark or white. Uh, vegans in particular are getting a uh, right treat as the... Oh, it's dairy. It's vegan. Oh, well, it's vegan. Oh, there you go, folks. I've done it anyway. It's vegan. It's vegan anyway. Uh, so what it is, folks, it's a drink. It comes in a cup, which is handy. Or it burn your balls if you uh, get it on them. All your bits, your lady bits, it might burn your lady bits and all, you might burn, you, you know, whatever. Um, you get the cream on the top, uh, Molly gave me a spoon, a see-through spoon, uh, to uh, get the uh, cream. Mmm, Costa do do. Exceptionally good cream. Um, this is what it looks like, folks, in there. Um, it's cream, apparently it's for love, the pink stuff. Um, and obviously it's... Um, Pink is love. Personally, I think it looks like another part of pink, uh, nipple pink, or other, other kinds of pinks are, are on the bodies. Um, I don't know how much it were. Forgot. Sorry. Let's, uh, let's sup in. Oh, that's bloody good. You get the, um, you get a milky flavour to it. Let me have a look, see what else is in that. Because it's a, it tastes quite, it tastes lovely, it really lovely. Um, pink ruby choc uh, cocoa, hot chocolate, which is super, it, I don't know, I don't recognise the taste. It's got like a sweet to it. The only thing I can say, folks, is you've got to go and try it. I've gone quiet, folks, and that don't happen often. Um, Cause I'm trying to recognize what it tastes like. I mean, it's like a pink chocolate. Let me get all the cream off. Right, get a bit of a swill up. Get a bit of a mix. Right, let me show you again what it looks like. Now, that's the colour of it, folks. Look at that for a pinkness. Hey, how pink can you get? Somehow out of Lady Penelope had... Uh, drink this in Thunderbirds. Parker, go down to Costa and get me another Ruby Curry, cor not a Ruby Murray, uh, Ruby Curry. Um, another one of those pink drinks. It is, it's got a sweet, soury taste to it. That 
that is good. I don't know why it's good though. It just it just tastes a bit different to the other kind of hot chocolate, cocoa kind of coffee drinks. I like it. I'm going to have that again. Not today, because I'm going to go home and wash the van. Van shit up. Can't believe it. Right, the thing is now, you get all this weather, don't you? Where it's like wet, then it's all dirty on the road, then you go bombing along, and then the sun comes out and it dries up all the rain, and um, it dirties your car up. And I'm not going to take it to Diamond today, because uh, I want to clean it myself. I just fancy cleaning it. Sometimes I do, I just want to clean the van myself. But that is good. That is really good. I think I might have to take June up the Costa and uh, I like that. It's good. Uh, there's not a lot more I can say about it, folks, to be fair. Um, if it is vegan, which I think it's, uh, it probably is, um, it's a win-win situation. Uh, no, I don't think it is vegan. I think it's just like sour milk. It don't say it's uh Uh, chocolate is a hot item right now with a sweet yet sour taste that's different to your standard milk, dark or white. So, and then it says vegans in particular are getting a... Let me drag it up on the Costa bloody website. Let's see if I can... Oh, God, touch phones. Costa menu. Hold on, ruby pink. Let's type that in. Ruby hot chocolate. Right, let's see what it says. 21 hours ago, and it was on Manchester Evening News. It's an Instagram dream. Instagram. Why do people do Instagram? It's all, they're all like trying to compete with each other with these stupid perfect houses that they all live in this stupid bubble. Just be real. Nobody lives like that on an Instagram. Uh, the new year means it's definitely time to change the celebrate. The coffee has made loads of vegan additions to its uh, menu, including coconut coffees and hot chocolates and meat-free smoky ham and blah de blah And uh, there's a millionaire short, but who don't want to give up the dairy. There's a millionaire short thing. Um, Sophie, Sophie Wehey. Uh, she tweeted, just found out Costa is selling pink hot chocolate. It's like all my dreams are coming true. Well, there you go. Uh, Costa is doing a pink hot chocolate, says Sick One Hun. And um, I feel I need more girlfriends to go and get one with. Whatever. Um, yeah, folks, I quite like this. Get yourself down, Costa. Give it a go. It's not your standard hot chocolate. It's got a sweet, fruity taste to it, like a blackcurrant, uh, not blackcurrant, a raspberry, that kind of thing. But I quite like it, and I will be bringing June up here and um, treating her to one. Very good. Laters.